What's going on? It's your boy Shadow back again with another YouTube video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And today's video is gonna be straightforward and straight to the point, quick, nice, and easy, and fast. You know what I'm saying? So this is um, how to adjust basically your uh, US Cutter SC model. Um, the best vinyl, one of the best vinyl cutters, uh, especially entry level vinyl cutters that you can buy. You know what I'm saying? So, basically, uh, what you do first is you, um, I'm out of breath, sorry about that, y'all. Uh, appreciate all the new subscribers. Right now, I'm at uh, 500 something, so thumbs up. Keep referring, keep sharing, keep doing what y'all are doing. Um, the only thing, more subscribers, more videos I make. But first things first, make sure your, your cutter's off, mine is on. Um, I'm a pro at this. If something happened, hit the like button <laughs> and call the ambulance. All right, so I'm going to loosen this up. Boom, nice and simple. Take this out. All right, so this is the interesting part right here. All right, so basically what I'm gonna do now, what I'm gonna do next, make sure my uh, tripod is focused and in center. I'm gonna try to get this as best as I can. All right? So I'm gonna take this out completely. I wanna take it out completely. So I'm just gonna take it out. All right. So the key to this is, all right, once you get your blades, right? I don't know if you can see this. Can y'all see that? Let me see if I can get it focused enough. All right, y'all see where the tip is, right? All right, so you see where this, it's kind of hard to explain, but you see the tip. If you see that tip, basically where the sharpest point is, where the sharpest point is to the point where it's, it starts to make that sharp incline, like where it's bending, it's like right there, right at the tip. Part. okay all right I don't know how else to explain this <laughs> but I'm gonna try my best to help you all out all right so we stick it in here <clears throat> all right let me see if I can get something that kind of focus this a lot better so y'all can see what I'm talking about oh right, yeah this is much better okay all right so so the part that I'm talking about is right here. The part I'm talking about is right there. Like this little part here. Stay focused on that little, you see this point here? There's another point right there where it bends. So this, the, the very tip and then where it meets at the on this side okay i hope i'm explaining this good all right all right so you put it back in there of course you press on this little press down on that let me do it again for you okay put it back in there there we go make sure it's nice and secure it can't come out all right and then we screw it down like i have mines already adjusted and I'm gonna show you how much of the blade should be sticking out. Like if this much of the blade is sticking out, <clears throat> let me get that focus. If this much of the blade is sticking out, then that's too much of the blade sticking out. All right, it should only be, you see this tip? And you see this little, you see this little uh, indentation here where it's, you know, where the tip is and that edge, that's the only thing that should be showing. So we're gonna adjust our blade so that that's the only thing that's gonna be showing, okay? So. All right. So let me see. Right there looks like where that little edge piece is meeting up okay 
And then what you do is tighten this little part up. Not the silver part, but this little metal piece. You know, if you miss the, um, if it's not aligned, then just do it again. You know what I'm saying? And let's see, is that enough? All right, so that edge, yep. That edge should meet right at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? So the, the point should be sticking out. And then the part, I don't even know how to explain it. But that part where it's, you know what I'm saying, where it's slanted, the little slanted part, that's the part where it's supposed to meet with the edge of this piece here. Let's see. Yeah. All right. So not too much, not too little. Just make sure that edge is flush with this part here. Okay. All right. And make sure it's nice and nice and tight, nice and tight. So we're going to bring this back over here with the settings that we put it on. And these settings work very well for me. This is a, um, I think this is a 64 degree blade. All right, so we're going to click uh, select. We're going to go to, I think we're already in uh, local. We're going to go to local. So click enter on local. And then once this screen pops up, we can go left and right. So we can make our test cut, okay? All right, my pressure, uh, what I'm working on now, I'm working on some like a glitter. It's a thicker type of vinyl. So now I think I'm gonna just estimate it's 69 grams pressure, downforce pressure. So I'm gonna go to test. I'm gonna do a test cut. All right, I'm gonna go back to local so I can see what I cut out. And this should be enough. It's usually pretty good. All right, so let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. See what we got. There you go. That's good. Of course, it's going to cut out a square. So everything around here should be a nice little cut square. You know, it should be a nice little square. Now, I hope this video made some kind of sense to you. Um, but that's the best way I can explain it. You know what I'm saying? So it's just that edge that little indentation so not the point of it but the um but that little groove part you know what i'm saying that little groove part that's the part that's supposed to be flush you can see it a little better on this angle so not that um for the 20th time i know y'all look like fed up with this shit <laughs> But uh, once again, you know, I'm holding it down. So not the point, not this little edge point here, but where it slopes up and meets with the rest of the blade. That look, that look sharp jump. You know what I'm saying? All right. And it's supposed to be flush with the edge of the housing so that it only leaves that much just the tip of the blade left okay all right if you like this video if it was helpful um hit the like button if i over explained it hit the like button um whatever you do just hit the like button hit the subscribe button <laughs> all right so let me know i hope this video helps somebody um let me know what y'all want to see more of uh what y'all want to see next and yeah peace subscribe gone